What is up YouTube? This is Python Curses Tutorial. In the last tutorial we uh, changed up some of the options and we made it so it's easily accessible for both the programmer and later on for the user. But the next thing I wanted to talk about was I wanted to create a menu. So the first thing is we have our game. We stored all of the information for running the game in a function called game. So conveniently enough what we can do is we can create another um, function called let's call it menu. So let's set curses dot no delay to zero because we want the thing to wait for us to do stuff. Um, let's see let's say our selection equals minus one and I'll explain why I want to do that a bit later here let me just make it so we can see some more stuff alright um, let's make option equals zero let's make the string no. let's say menu words right here let's say while selection equals or is less than zero right now selection is one so it will continue to run the loop until we make a selection um, so the first thing we want to do is how about uh, the first thing I want to show you is um, I think I showed you up above or in previous tutorials I said things like curses dot a underscore bold or something like that you can use another one called normal which means don't change anything but instead of writing that you could just write zero so what I want to do is I want to make a list of um, yeah graphics equals zero times five I think that will give us something yeah, that's what we want. And then let's say graphics. And let's say the option graphics. Ooh, I must have spelled that. Jeez, that's embarrassing. Okay. So let's say this is equal to curses.a. Um, how about reverse? Um, and then I'll show you why I wanted to do this in just a second. So now, let's see, we'll do curses, no, not curses, screen dot add string. Uh, let's say, how about, you know, just zero. Oh, I'll leave that blank for now. And then, snake, Ugh. one, two, three, so how about dims, zero. Or one over two and then minus three because that's about half of this thing here and then screen dot add string dims zero over two minus so we're gonna have five things so let's see one two three. so minus two um, dims one over two and then play and since this is about two things this is four things long we will subtract two from here uh, more details about uh, you know centering stuff like this can be seen in the adding strings video from other videos oh and here's what I wanted to do was um, I wanted to add the attribute curse or no graphics zero and then I'm going to repeat this so if I'm gonna make this graphics one I'm gonna make this something like I don't know instructions I'll show you how we can add instructions later on what's the length of this one two three four five six seven 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. So minus 6. 
and then this will be minus one let's make this two uh, how about instead of instructions what else could we add how about game options and this is the same length as instructions which is nice um, we'll get rid of the minus one there since so this this is to make sure everything is centered on the screen and this is to make it so that this is on top this is right below that because it's one more than that because you're subtracting one less um, and then we're going to do a couple more screen dot add string oh, I can just paste be lazy this will be plus one this will be three let's see what should we do now how about high scores I'll show you how to do this later okay and then this will probably be about more like minus five maybe yeah and then the last one is you want this to be four and let's do a nice simple sweet exit minus two since two is half the length of the string and plus two. Oh, I might also want to clear the screen because I remember I had some funky weird stuff like that last time screen dot clear um, let's see I think that's about good and then um, we're going to have action equals screen dot get ch oh, I'm going to want to refresh this screen dot refresh so action so now let's see if the computer if, if action equals curses dot key up I think I have curses keypad turned on yeah I have screen keypad here so if this is up then Let's say action equal or not action. Um, option equals option minus one percent sign five. Lf action equals curses dot key down. Then we're going to make the option get bigger by one. Option plus one. But we still want it to be a value from zero to four. Okay. So let's test that. I'll save this. Oh, I need to call the menu first. So let's replace the game here with the menu here. Mm. Oh, it's screened out no delay. Neo battle. Save that. Close this. There we go. So now I can choose to do stuff. Um. Yeah. Oh, and I forgot to make it so. Let's do that now. Elif action equals. O R D enter then selection equals option and that will help us exit the loop. So yeah I have to uh -uh. Hmm. Yeah, this is a problem. What's my option? My option should be up for right now. Hmm.
Oh, I think I just forgot to save it. Yeah, there we go. Well, actually, as soon as you select anything, it's gonna exit. Um, so let's fix that now. If selection equals zero, game. So now, if selection is zero, which means we have selected play. Oh God. I need to clear the screen. No, let's just clear the screen here. After you make a choice, then you're going to just clear the screen anyway. So, there we go. We are good to go. Uh, that'll be all for this tutorial. Um, next time will be, I'll show you how to maybe change game options, show instructions. Um, other stuff like that in future videos to come. Thank you all for watching. Please comment, rate, and subscribe if you feel like doing so. And I will see you all in the next tutorial. Thank you very much.